I mean, it's just a defense with a lot of talent, and they, they're coached very well. Manny Diaz is a great coordinator, and I feel like he puts them in the right spots at the right time, and they just let their athleticism show. Um, you got guys like Joey Porter that are just extremely gifted physically, and they're in the right spots at the right time. So it's a, it's a tremendous opportunity for us as an offense to be able to put ourselves up against that and really see what we're all about. Uh, to the far back, Doug. What are some keys to try and hook up on some of those deep shots mm -hmm. that you guys have taken? Uh, for sure. I mean, probably the biggest key and the only key is just myself, you know, just putting the ball on them and just really like, Understanding that as I'm recovering from this injury from the off season, that uh, like I'm starting to gain my strength back. I'm starting my hips are more mobile. They've gained more strength, um, and just being able to get back into that rhythm again and not be able to feel like that I need to put my all into a throw and just realize I have a strong arm. And just focus on it, see the ball through the throw, and just deliver it to them. But the guys have been doing great getting open. I just got to put the ball on them. Alejandro? Uh, you've talked several times now about the offense only scratching the surface. Mm -hmm. uh, what, what exactly do you mean by that? What is left uh, to uncover? For sure. Um, it's just when you talk about potential and you look at what we have as a group and you look at who we're coached by and you look at what we're doing on the field, it's just not matching up with our potential and where we should be and where we're going to be. I mean, everything's a process and this entire season is just continual growth week to week, but I just feel like we should be not getting stopped offensively with the talent that we have and the scheme that's put in. We shouldn't be stopped. So just being able to find our groove like we did in the second half, every single drive of every single game is gonna be huge. And once we do that, then, then we'll break through that surface for sure. Okay, on the far left there, Corey. Last year for this game, you were you, you dressed, but you didn't participate. But now, fast forward a year, now you're the starter heading into such a big game, a lot of chips mm -hmm. on the line. Like, what does it mean for you to be a part of that now and have such a big role heading into it? For sure. I mean, a any game that I suited up for last year and didn't play, I, I had that game marked on my calendar for this year. And uh, just like I said, just embracing the opportunity. I mean, this is a great team. Um, being able to play them in the big house is a blessing, that's for sure, with the maze out and all the fans that are going to be showing up and bringing that energy. But, yeah, it's just it's just a tremendous opportunity, and I, I can't wait to do it. I can't wait to go out there and show what I can do against that great team. JJ, I heard that you're going to Chick-fil-A tonight. Uh, Sometimes you should be back at the household uh, <laughs> with, uh, to bring the Chick-fil-A to your household. That's a question you can answer. Because you're going. Uh, but we, I heard that you guys take turns going every week. And you uh, didn't go last week. On uh, Monday, Tuesday, you went to him, Chris. Uh, I did go last week, though. Could you repeat that? I did go last week. To Chick fil A? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Or it was two weeks ago. That's what I mean. What game was that? No, it wasn't after the game, it was during the week. Thank you for your time. Okay, yeah. <laughs> hey, safe travels to Chick, man. <laughs> That's a far drive, so yeah. We, we take turns, we rotate. <laughs> yeah, 30 minute piece right there. Yeah. Some real teammate love right there. Uh, Donovan Edwards with the hard hitting questions. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was crazy. We're ready for that one. I was not. Uh, <laughs> all right, we'll, we'll get back to the normal schedule here. On the left with Aaron. JJ, you said the offense shouldn't be stopped. What do you think? That, what do you think it is that's pulling it back? Um, I mean, it's just building up that chemistry. I mean, it, this is our first year together. We've had six games, but I feel like as you could see through every week, we've been growing and different areas as an offense. So I feel like just if we continue to be on this track, to continually exponentially grow in the right direction, uh, by the end of the year, by Ohio State, we're gonna be right where we want, for sure.